This is Channel 2 News, coverage you can count on. We were determined to get it um, funded, and that's what we had to do yesterday. There's a lot of um, you know, trust that needs to be reestablished at this point. The lawmakers are working on a budget that would fund public education, but they're still at odds over a few details. Continuing coverage tops Channel 2 News at 5 o'clock. Glad you can be with us. I'm Kristen Remington. Landon is off tonight. Less than an hour ago, the Assembly passed an education budget, 27 to 15 in a party line vote. Paul Nelson joins us now live in Carson City after talking to lawmakers about the education budget. And Paul, what is the very latest? Well, Kristen, Republicans say they won't vote for any budget that doesn't include the education savings accounts. And since those aren't included, Democrats are moving forward without them. In fact, the Senate passed this same bill last night without a single Republican on hand. The legislature is split on balancing the state's budget just two days after it appeared a bipartisan effort was in place. Republicans are upset that money for the ESA program is gone because Democrats are using it to pay for public education. We had a deal. That deal was reneged on without telling us anything. And I will not vote for a budget of any sort until that happens. Uh, you know, they, they can obviously interpret this the way they want to, spin it the way they want to. Uh, everyone in this building knows who's been involved in this conversation, however, that the conversation was ongoing. There was no firm deal. There was no meeting of the minds. Lawmakers have to balance the budget by Monday, and Democrats say the education bill is the biggest step. There's great things for every single Nevadan inside of those budgets, and a lot of work has been put into these budgets by Democrats and Republicans. But the Washoe County School District says it's getting less money than it expected based on the funding formula, leaving it with a $6.6 .6 million a year shortfall for the next two years. Now, we'll continue to go back and be responsive, and we've got teams right, you know, that have been working basically the last few days um, to ensure that, that everything is accurate, and so far everything is. The formula bases per pupil spending on local revenue generated and student population growth. Under this budget, Washoe County will get 19 more dollars per student, while Clark County gets 126. Something is happening in that mechanism that's making that change. Uh, it's not the district's fault. It's uh, something that's happening here at the state level, and we're trying to figure out what that is right now. Now, the education budget gets the most attention, but there's four other budgets, including the capital improvements projects as well. Republicans say they won't vote for those ones either because of the ESA issue. The next big question is whether Governor Brian Sandoval plans on signing or vetoing this bill. Covering the 2017 legislature live, Paul Nelson, Channel 2 News. And boy, Paul, they are racing the clock. All right, we'll follow it closely. Thank you for that live report. A bill